Hi everyone, and welcome back to my channel. I know I might be looking a little bit strange, and that is because I don't have any eye makeup on, and that is because today we're going to be doing swatches and a tutorial using the Stoph X Makeup Revolution eyeshadow palette now I have had this in my cupboard for a long time I have not yet used it I've just been so busy studying and um, just doing so many other things like I just have not got round to filming a tutorial with it yet and I wanted the first swatches and everything like that to be done for you guys in front of you guys so I have been holding off using it I have opened it and looked at it quite a lot <laughs> like I've just been like dying to touch it but um no I've kept it completely clean for you guys and I am just so so excited so this is the carton the colours are printed on the back it's beautiful beautiful packaging and it comes like this it's very very pretty very very sleek and just like with all Makeup Revolution palettes it comes with the sheet of the shade names which I love and da da how gorgeous is this palette it is stunning Soph did such an amazing job with this it is literally like my dream palette like that green is calling me I'm gonna do something with that green <laughs> um first of all I'm just gonna get the swatches done for you guys I'm just gonna do them on my arm and show you and then we will dive straight in and do a look with this palette and I'm very very excited so here we have the first two lines of the swatches here we have penguin pancakes fairy lights pink champagne iced coffee and cup of tea and on this side we have grow old sparks fly smoky bronze mixed berries which i think is just such a cute name tiramisu and peaches at the bottom and they are the first two rose and them swatches are just beautiful I love them so here is the second two rows so there's obviously four rows all together so this is the third and the fourth row um, and we have the shades cloudberry pumpkin pine tree petrol pug and danger and then on this side we have strawberry sweets festive flame copper coin Mug Cake, Rosewood and Nightmare is the black at the bottom. These are such, such gorgeous colours. I am obsessed with these swatches and I just, I cannot wait to get started. I am literally dying to use the shade Pine Tree, so I'm definitely going to be using this green shade here. I'm obsessed with that and I'm thinking some browns and some browns in the crease and then that on the lid that's what I'm feeling at the moment I think that's going to be quite a nice look so let's dive straight in I'm going to grab a blending brush uh, we go? let's go for this one that's a nice one to go in the crease with and let's start off with pancakes which is this gorgeous shade right here I'm just going to take pancakes and just pop it all over my lid and all over the eye as my base it's literally like the perfect tone for my skin I love this shade for going all over So that is that done. I'm gonna like go in with a cup of tea here. I'll have to take a little bit of the excess. I'm just gonna run this into my crease and on the outer corners. I'm just gonna do little circular motions and run that into the crease. I love this shade. This shade is beautiful. You know, using this as our transition shade. Oh, I'm obsessed. With this palette already, I've used two shades out of it on my eyes. I love it. I just... Oh.
right, I'm very, very happy with how that's placed and it blends so, so nicely. So I'm very happy with that. So that was cup of tea. Now I'm gonna go in with a bit of mug cake and take a different brush. It takes me longer to pick the brushes than it does to do the actual makeup look. Just going in with another fluffy headed brush. I'm just going to take Mug Cake, which is this beautiful shade right here. And this is going to be the one that deepens the outer corner. I'm just going to pop that in the outer corner. And run that into the crease as well. But I'm not going to take it as high and I'm not going to take it as far in either. I'm going to go in again with that same shade that I used for the cup of tea and the pancakes. I'm just going to blend out the edge. And again, I'm going to go back in with mud cake again and just start building up that colour on the outer corner. So I'm quite happy with that. I'm just going to blend out edge again and just gonna copy that on this side I'm gonna go in with my finger and pine tree and I'm just gonna take a bit on my finger and start pressing that into my lid Wow It's so pretty, oh my gosh. Just like that. So that is the green on. I love it. I Ooh. obsessed. Oh, freaking obsessed. I love it so so much. I love it. Right now, I do need to lighten my inner corner slightly. Um, so I think I'm gonna go with Sparks Fly, which is this kind of goldy shade here. Mm, just gonna take it on a brush. I think I'm gonna try it with a brush. Um, and we'll see how we get on. Right, so I've taken some on my little brush. I'm just gonna hit it with a setting spray. I'm just gonna put this on my inner corner. Sorry, it goes on like that. <laughs> Which side did I do it? Thank you. 
love, love, love. Right, so that is the gold done on the inside. I'm just going to go back in with my cake. And just blend out the green and the brown on the outer corner. Like so. And I am just going to pop off camera, do my lashes, and I will be right back. So I have put on my false lashes, and I have put on um, some dark brown eyeliner in my waterline and I've also put some mascara on my lower lashes. Now I'm going to go in with which colour? I'm just going to take um, a cup of tea and run it along my lower lash line. So that is a cup of tea and then I'm going to take mug cake I'm just going to press it into the outer corner, so like this, just get it right up there and just wiggle that in, just to darken the outer corner slightly, and the same on the other side. That is my lower lash line done, and I'm just going to, for highlight now, for the inner corner and for my brow bone, I'm going to go in with Fairy Lights, which is this gorgeous, really pale shimmer shade. I'm just going to pop that on the inner corners of my eye. going to use it to highlight my brow bone as well because I really love this shade. Now that is done. For my cheeks, my nose and my cupid's bow, I'm going to go in with the Pearl Lights Loose Highlighter from Makeup Revolution in the shade Peach Champagne. I'm just going to run this down my nose. Ooh. Oh, my nose, nose. Cupid's bow. This is so freaking pretty. I love it. I'm living for this highlight. Oh, the glitter my loose little. And the cupid's eye. I'm just oh, living for this. Now for my lips. I'm going to go in with the Makeup Revolution Retro Lux Matte Lip Kit in the shade Noble. And I just think it will go really nicely with the browns and stuff. Setting the thing in my eyes. So let me use the Soph Mirror. And this kit, this lip contour kit, contains a lip liner and a matte liquid lipstick. And just look. So let me just line my lips. I do have lip balm on, so let's kiss off my lip balm. So that is my lips lined. Oh, 
I am ob obsessed with this lip combo. And of course, the in spray. I hope you enjoyed watching this video. Give it a thumbs up if you are obsessed with the new Sofex Makeup Revolution. I really, really am. And yeah, it gets a 10 out of 10 for me. Like I am obsessed with this makeup look. I really, really love it. And you did an amazing job with this soap. Congratulations. And as always, Makeup Revolution kills it with all their other products that I've shown you in this video as well. Like I'm just, just I'm a revaholic, I can't even help it. Like, Makeup Evolution is just the one for me, honestly. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you like me, if you like this video, please give it a massive thumbs up and hit that subscribe button. If you aren't already subscribed to my channel, I'd appreciate it more than you know. And until next time, guys, take care. Bye.